Yo, yo, yo. Man, I had two two songs playing at the same time. What up, though? Happy Friday. What is good, everybody? Salute. Salute, salute, salute. Don't forget to vote. Thank you all for coming in. Smack that thumbs up, too, guys. I'm looking at that poll live. And Plexus just took the lead. What up, though? Nobody's using that K that K source anymore. I guess not. Nobody's using that K source. What up, though? What's good? What is good? Uh, let me get everything situated back here. All right. Let's get everything situated. What up, though? What's good, Lenore? Lady Sun God is in the building. We got 25 people in here. Go on, smack that thumbs up. Smack it up. Flip it. What up, though? There we go. There we go. What up, though? What's good? Happy Friday, guys. Today, we're going to get into a little, uh, just a little detail. But first, before I start that, I got to put these bad boys up. I got to put these up. All right. Y'all know what it is. Got to put them up. Oh, man. Just in case. Just in case. All right. It's almost Halloween. All right. So I guess I'm going to go ahead and slide these boys right over here. I don't know. I may have to take these right here. I'm going to slide these down. I love the Miz, just in case y'all don't know. The Miz J's, right? All right. Just in case. Ah, man. I might rock those boys tomorrow. What is good? Happy Friday, guys. It is August the 5th. A couple movies came out today. I don't know if y'all are aware of it. Um, Prey. Prey came out. The Predator. Um, I watched a little bit of it. Um, I didn't get too deep in it yet, but it looked like it was all right. Um, also, there's a movie with uh, um, Ethan. No, not Ethan. Why do I always say Ethan? Kevin Bacon called them. They are them. <laughs> They are them. So I'm going to check that out as well. But what is up? What is good? Salute to everybody. Don't forget to, uh, you know, uh, smack that thumbs up. All right. So let me see. What up, though? What up? I'm trying to get everything situated. What up, Lady Sun Goddess? Lenore, Dave in the building. What's up, Miss Erlene? What's up, Sandy Kirk? What's up, baby? Rich in the building. What is up? What's up, Rich? Uh, let me see. Miss Billy is in the building. Say, yo, Dale, I hit you in the PayPal, sir. Let me see. Let's see. Let's see what we got here. Let's see what we got. I just checked it about at least about an hour and a half ago. So Miss Billy must have sent something. Let's see. Let's see. All right. All right. I got you, Miss Billy. I got you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll take care of you shortly. Uh, Miss T. Harper, salute, salute, salute. You know who you are. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Appreciate the love and PayPal. All right. So let me put that over here just in case, just in case somebody else do something. Let me do this. Let me see if I can set it like right that. Maybe we'll see some numbers change. The PayPal link is in the description if you want to show some love. Um... Also, before we get it started, uh, consultations, they're booking up quick. Remember, I'm going to email y'all today for people who was trying to get on the list 
I told y'all to email me Friday. I got like six emails. No, maybe about six. Well, when I got off work, it was like six, seven emails because I was going through them throughout the day at the job. So I don't know how many is on there right now, but if you want the consultation, how to start your media library, that's um, if you want your music, your movies, your TV shows, pictures, I will help you get that started. Um, just email me and then we'll go from there. Now, the consultation to help you start your, your media library is 50 bucks. All right. $50. 50 moolahs. You know, uh, that's just how it is. Uh, no, no trading on here. I had somebody who tried to trade me. I don't do any trades or anything like that. So that's just what it is. The link is in the description of this video. But email me first. Email me first before you send anything, just to make sure you get on that list. All right. So anybody that was set up for a consultation tomorrow, be on the lookout. You're going to get an email tonight. I'm going to send you the payment link. And then that way we move forward. All right. I do things a little bit different here because any anything can happen, you know, and I just want to make sure we're on the same page. So just remember that. All right, so you definitely remember that right there. Uh, who else is up in here? That was Miss Billy. Elijah, what up, though? What is good? Dennis, what up, though? What up, though, Jimmy? What's good with you, Jimmy? Rich, little poor boy, what up, though? Say, I'm here for the goodies. You definitely going to get a little bit of it today. What up, though, Thomas? What's good? What's good? Miss Gail is in the building. What's up, baby? I heard your boy take a shot at me too, Miss Gail. He why did why he be mad because you be, you sung to me like four years, three four years ago. He's still upset. Hey, he he upset. He better hope we don't never seen fire and desire. I tell you that. He really he might jump off his balcony. <laughs> he might jump off the balcony. Lord, leave them. Uh, what up, though? What up, Steven? Uh, Just G is in the building. The bird, oh, what up, though? Courtney in the building. What's up? Devar, what up, though? What's good? What's good? See, Oliver made it. I see you over there. You know he going to be mad, so we better, we better not say nothing, Miss Gail. You broke that man's heart like that. You shouldn't break his heart. All right, let's get into it. Let's get into it. As y'all saw right here. Let me go and put it um, up here, and then we're going to move on from there. Y'all saw the list. Um, the easiest way to start your media library, all right? To me, I just think it's the easiest way when you, when you really start getting into it and you want to start your library. Where is it at? <laughs> Uh, where you at? Where are you at? Where you at? Where you at? All right, here you go right here. So let me add this to your screen. We're going to jump straight into it. Look, I don't use pretty much every media library platform, right? I don't, that's just how it is. I don't, I don't use Plex. I tried, um, MB. It just wasn't for me. Um, I haven't tried Jellyfin. I haven't done just plug directly into like a a, a, a a television, and also I um what else? Uh, I didn't try just plugging into like a Archer HD or Blu-ray player and all of that. Um, to me, when it comes to setting up your device, all right, we're talking about the easiest. Um, Plex is very, very nice. It, look, I have nothing against Plex. People who want to use Plex, definitely use it. All right. I have nothing against Plex. But when you're talking about the ease of it, everybody is not going to get it as, you know, as we will get it. You know, um, not the new people. Um, and sometimes you just have to spend money. That's just the nature of our business. We always say at what? 
You got to spend money in order to what? Save money. And a lot of people do not understand that. You know, they're going to, oh, get Plex, oh, get Envy, get this, get that. You know, not everything for free is going to be working for you. That's the only thing about it. Everything that's free, yeah, it's cool, but you have to baby that bad boy. You have to baby that bad boy. And it's so many things that you um, you could do um, to ease the pain. Now, if you want to take on a challenge, I will tell you to try Plex. I got a Plex playlist that still works to this day because of what I get comments that say, hey, I followed you step by step. Not everybody want to go through that process. So to me, I think the easiest way without j just getting your content and loading it, I think the easiest way is to get a device like to do. Now, I'm not no spokes, um, no spokesman of them. Um, I'm never that. I'm never a spokesman for them. But I just think when it comes to the ease of starting it i think it's amazing and then when it gives off um um the server you know it allows whatever you have connected to it so if you have all your movies your music every anything that's connected and you can share it within your home network i think is good now if you want to take it to another level you will get something like plex where you can share it with people outside of your household but some people gonna sit back and say oh man you can share it with your family and friends this and that and that is absolutely true some people gonna say oh you can take your media and everything um on the road with you that is absolutely true the thing about it when you go on the road if you don't have good internet your plex is not gonna do well you will have to download some stuff for um for um off off like when you off the grid you're gonna have to download and then go from there that's just the, the nature of the business um that that's just what it is all right uh, with that i just think there are other devices that do well that you don't have to use any internet. Plex is good, but when you up in the air in that sky, if you don't um, pre-download the content for not having internet, you will not get your Plex. And so we talked about other devices, well, at least one device um, that will do that for you. So don't get me wrong, I think Plex is very, very nice. Plex is lovely. It's beautiful, but you do have to maintain it. A light, I'm talking about when you got to maintain it, you got to check on this bad boy like almost every day. And if a person come and say, oh, I don't, I check my Plex once every month, I don't believe them. Unless they just not doing anything with the Plex. One thing I found out, and I done had the Plex on the NVIDIA Shield, I done had the Plex on a Windows PC. I done had it on a mini PC. And I have my Plex on my router, the Night, the Netgear Nighthawk X10. I have it. Um, the thing about it, you don't watch your Plex. <laughs> I'm telling you now. If you don't watch your Plex, you will wake up, let's just say if you ain't watched it in two weeks. Maybe you were just busy. Maybe you was out of town handling business or seeing families and friends. There's a guarantee because you have not watched it, it will go offline. It will go offline. And that's just the nature of the business. It will go offline. Um, even though you, you haven't did anything, you will wake up. And that was the thing about with the NVIDIA Shield, that I just got tired of just coming down. Even though the shield is on, the green light is on, I always found myself having to go down there, unplug, plug it back in, wait for it to load up, three to five minutes later, boom. But who wants to wake up, you know, who up who up at two, three o'clock in the morning 
And then you be like, you know what? Shoot, I'm going to sit back. I ain't sleepy. I'm going to watch this. And then you got to be like, man, ain't this something? Man, I got to go way downstairs. Well, the thing about it, I haven't had that type of issue with my Zadu. Now, others may have ran into some problems. I don't know. I haven't I haven't personally ran into, ran into that problem as of yet. One thing I learned about the Zadu, get it. And just make I made I made two folders, movies, and I made uh on TV shows. That is it. That's all that is on my um to do. Any type of movie, I don't care if it's kids movies, I don't care. I put it in that one folder. And Zadu do, does all the rest. It'll let you know what you just put on there. Which I'm gonna show y'all because I got I got to update it. I recorded um the shy um six and seven. All right. Keyword, if you know what I mean. Um, so I got to transfer them over to my Zadu. I'm gonna show you. Shout out um uh, um uh, shout out to Lady Sun Goddess. She wanna see this again, and I'm gonna show you how I use my Zadu. I don't care if I'm on the PC upstairs, on the laptop. I don't care if I'm on my Chromebook. I don't care if I'm right here. I'm able to connect to the Zadu just like people connect to their server, their NAS or whatever, their external, I mean, or their um, router and just drag and drop. With the Explorer app, it does the same thing. That way I can be upstairs and I know the 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 server, the URL, when I turn on the file sharing, the Wi-Fi file sharing. And it doesn't matter if you on Wi-Fi or you hardwired because my Chromebook is Wi-Fi. And I'm up there and I can send it directly down here um, and then upload it straight to the, uh, the Zadu. I love the Zadus because all the Zadus talk to each other and everything. So it's it's an amazing device. I just think that's why I call this video. I call this video to me, in my personal opinion, the easiest way to start your movie library. I think it's good to get any one of these devices or anything that's very, very similar that has um a network, a Samba network. All right. Samba means if you get if you get a device that has Samba. That means it will allow you to share whatever you have on that device across your network. Now, the NVIDIA Shield does the same thing. All right. It allows you to, to plug a device up and share it as well. All right. It allows you. But the thing about it is it do has a what? A home theater app that is very, very nice. Very, very nice. And I'll show it to y'all. Uh, let me get to some of these comments. Uh, let me see. Mac is in the building. What up, though, Mac? What is good? Cordelia, what's up? What's up? <laughs> I say don't want no smoke. <laughs> I feel you, Miss Girl. I feel you. Uh, Doug Brad, what up, though? What's good? What is good? Who else dropped up in here? What's up, Rose? I see you. What's up, baby? How you doing? How you doing? Um... They say Plex does have a short but sleeping learning curve. Absolutely. Plex is fabulous if you're willing to put the work in. But if you're somebody that doesn't just, you know, just don't want that type of curving and learning, then I got to show you the easiest device. Um, I just think it's so easy just to feed this bad boy and walk off. That's just me. That's just me. D. Johnson in the building. What up, though? What's good? Cordelia say, what up, though? What's good? What is good? Um, So, salute. Popcorn. Popcorn. What up, though? Say, library on Blaze. Thanks, bro. A big salute. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the donation. I got you popcorn. 
What up, though? What's good? Thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'm about to show y'all minds in just a second. What up, though? Mix, what's good with you, man? Hope all is well. What is good? And salute again. Let me give him another salute. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And what's up, Latif? What up, though? What's good? All right? So let's get into it. Now, I'm going to have to do some changes because the device that I have down here is my main device. And, of course, it has some applications on it that I cannot share with y'all. All right? You know how the haters are. There are a few of them out there. They watch, they watch us all the time. They definitely watch me just to see if I can slip up. Because y'all know the story. Y'all know the story how, you know, <laughs> y'all know the story. But anyway, let me do this. Let me do this. And don't forget to smack that thumbs up. Uh, not forget to smack that thumbs up. Also, we got Plex over here killing Zadu. Can't say, Dale, forget what you talking about. Dude, you taught us how to use Plex and then you turned your back on us? But uh, Plex is leading 51%. Um, Zadu is in um, 29, a distant 29. And then you got NB at 11%. And then you got the K source that stand for Cody at, at 8%. All right. I'm quite sure. I'm quite sure the, the the people that are on Plex are from people who either started it before I taught it. They they may have been already on Plex or when I put together the playlist. And again, also Plex is what free, All right? You talking about a paid device that's over two hundred and some dollars, and then you got a free app, <laughs> and you tell like uh. Dell, I ain't got that $230, man. I'm going to go with this free application. I can't blame you. There's nothing better than free. All right? We all know what comes with free. You're going to, hey, it's free, but you're going to have to put in that work. Then you got paid that says, look, you already paid for it, so we'll do all the work for you. And so that's the difference, all right? That is the difference. So salute to all Plex users. I'm... Listen, I'm gonna start doing these um these polls right here. I'm gonna start doing it. Cause Plex, I love me some Plex, but Plex is something. Hold up, somebody hit me up. Somebody hit me up. I don't know who hit me up, but somebody hit me up. Somebody hit me up. Let me see. All right. Oh, somebody hit me up. All right. So that was another notification right there, which is cool. That's what's cool. All right. Let me do this. Y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Again, if you're not familiar with the Explorer app, I got like four or five videos on it. But if you're ready to learn how to transfer your content, it is so easy, all right? It's very, very, very easy. Very, very easy. I'm going to show you how to transfer using a computer or whatever. I don't care if you're on your Chromebook. I don't care if you're on your, your, your PC, all right? I don't care, all right? What I'm going to do first... And let me do this before I even start because you know the haters is out there and that's what they do. So let me share this. The haters be like, yo, let's see if we can catch them slipping. <laughs> All right, let me do this. Uh, let me see. All right, so let me do this. All right. Let's switch it up. So here you have, this is the application right here. And again, I am on a different um, device. OK, 
okay? And to show you that I'm on a different device, this is how mine's look, all right? This is the Zidu Z1000 Pro, all right? It's a little bit different than y'all's. You know, even though I, I still got my other one hooked up, I can show you that one as well. But this is a little bit different, but the same concept. All right. Same, same concept. Um, let me do this. In order, so if you get this to do, what you have to do is go over here to network. And you see that option down there that says Samba? In order to share this across your network, you got to turn Samba on. All right. You got to turn this on. If you don't turn it on, it will not share your network. All right. That's just the name of the game. Now, you can give your server a name. To, in order to give it a name, you got to go down here to modify. All right. You got to click on modify and then you can give it a name. All right. You don't have to give it a password unless you want to. All right. So if I wanted to enable the password, I could turn it on and give it whatever I want. Eight, 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 whatever. I can give it whatever I want. Um, but in this case, I'm not going to enable the password. But I do understand why people do it. Once you're done, so so just remember, you have to turn on the Samba server. All right, you have to turn on the Samba server in order to share your library on your device. Now, people didn't know this device is also a portable hotspot, meaning you can actually turn this bad boy on and it will give itself a network. See, we don't talk about that. Say if you got some family or friends coming to your house, you could turn on this hotspot right here and it will activate, and then you can change it from, you can hit modify, you can change the name, you can change the password, security, and you can take it from 2.4 to 5G as well, all right? And then you can just hit save, and that way when anybody come over, hey, let me get the password, you can, instead of them putting them, putting them on the main network, you can give them this one. All right, you can get it this one. So a lot of us don't even talk about this. This is another feature that you get with this device. The Shield don't even give you a portable hotspot. All right, it's only a few devices. I know you got a couple of Android devices that actually allow you to connect to the portable hotspot that you can create right here. Now, I don't need it, so I'm not going to do all of that. But that just shows you what it is, all right? That's just how it is. And again, you can just go over here and click save once you're done and then be done with it. But that's just, that's one of the features. But this one is the main one, all right? As you see, my server name is called Big Boy, all right? And of course, you, you know, you can do Bluetooth. You can connect it to the Ethernet, which mine is connected to the Ethernet, all right? You see the Samba server up there, that 168.1.76? That's going to come into play, all right? So when you over there, you looking, you see the access address, that 192.168.1.76, that is what you just keep an eye on that because that's what we're going to use. Now, let me do this. Let me hit the home. Let me go into my library. And so, as you see right here, this is the movie right here with um, Kevin Bacon. I'm definitely going to watch that. Um, probably, if not tonight, tomorrow. And so, you see my collection of Predator. All right. And so, this is the newest one right here. I got it in 4K. And I got it in, um, you know, 1080p, as you see right there. And one thing about Zadoos. If you leave it there for a good five seconds, it actually shows you the trailer in the top left-hand corner, uh, in the top right-hand corner. So, again, like, whatever movie I click on, it sits back, and, like, in, like, five to ten seconds up in the top right-hand corner, 
it displays the trailer, which is a beautiful thing as well. That's why a lot of people like this. But here it is right here. This is just the movie art um, for my movie library. Again, it can separate it by action. So if I click all my action, it will bring up all my action films. All right, anything that got a little action in it, it will separate. No, that's the beauty of this. You do not have to separate like Plex. Some people, you're going to have to deal with that. That's just the nature of the business. Adventure, all your ventures, including what? Animation as well. It's an adventure. All right, so you have that. Anything with adventure, comedy, anything that has humor in it. All right, anything that has humor in it, it's going to bring you right here. All right, and you see how much content I have, right? Romance, all right? All your romance movies, all right? Well, the ones that I have romance, all right? Should be a little bit more, but it's all good. Science fiction, it separates it. I'm talking, and that's a beautiful thing. It separates it. That's the difference between Plex and Zadu. With Plex, you have to do this. You have to create and say, hey, this is my adventures or whatever like that. Anything animation, it will bring all my animations right here. Even Friday, the animated series. So when I go to it, I have all the series right here. Okay? Simple as that, all right? Space Jam. I love how if it has um, a collection of films, it brings them all together. It creates that for you, all right? You do not have to do the hard work, all right? That's the beauty of it. Crime. Again, anything with crime, and you see it's pulling up, it pulls up, even TV shows and movies, because all of it has crime, all right? That's just the nature of the business. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So across this platform, horror movies, you get anything that has horror movies make you scared, it's going to go in here. And if it's a collection, just like this, it will put them all together. All right, it will put them all together as long as you have it like that. Uh, and if I'm not mistaken, they got a uh, they got this movie. I think I, this this one is uh, Orphan First Kill is at the movies. All right, I don't know if it's a prequel to this. I don't I don't know, but this was a, a kind of a cool film crazy but but and that's the difference between us and then you can just hit the plus and you can go up in here right and just you know anything with music in it you know you could just anything with war so you can add war you can add history to this um you can add action and adventure you can go up in here and just you know and just add to it and then when you come out you can go back up in your categories and you can just go up in here and look at all my all my content with Westerns. All right? And so you see it right here. Django, that was my movie right here. Django, you son of a... All right? Let's see what's in Action and Adventures. All right? So you getting that. Anything with Action and adventure, You should... It seems like that'll have a little bit more. I don't know. History... I just added this, so I guess they just talking about history, our history. Anything that's uh like true documentary turned into a movie. So that's pretty cool too. So all of this is what you would get. And we went into animation, I think. Yep, so that's that's the difference between as a dude. Now, this is what we got. This is what we got, because I'm going to show you how to add your content, all right? I'm going to show you 
how to use the Explorer app. Lady Sun Goddess, get ready with your pen and paper because we're about to get this party started. Now, let me do this. All right. Uh, let me remove this because I got to go into something. All right. And you know, in order for me to get to it, I got to go up in here and show you some apps, right? I got to go into my apps. And again, the haters be watching so much. That's just how it is. It's crazy how we just can't be on one team, but it's all good. All right? So now let me get that back going. All right? So here it is. This is the Explorer app. This is one of the best apps to have today now again i am on my zidu z1000 i have a, a six terabyte internal drive all right when i put it in after it's all said and done if you look up in the the yellow i don't know if you can see it or not but this yellow it tells me after everything was installed that it was 5.5 terabytes left now it says that I have 3.5 terabytes of space to use. That is a lot of space, all right? Again, when I click on it, not that one, when I go over here and highlight, so all you want to do, the first thing you want to do is highlight your drive, all right? Just highlight it. That way you know it's yours. You see two sections all right this is going to come android because i am using the android and this lost dot directory that that pretty much just pops up there's nothing in there um but it pops up on all android devices but again i'm focused on these two right here all right these two so listen if you got to say you recorded something right you record it, or maybe you ripped your movies. Maybe you got a DVD collection or a Blu-ray connect, um, collection or even an Archer HD. With, or you might have some personal information. This is the easiest way. Now, you could do what I used to do. Put your hard drive into your computer or your flash drive into your computer and actually get it, right? Get it. Put it on your flash drive and then plug it into your Zadu or whatever device you use and transfer it that way. I'm not doing that. I'm not going to do it. But what I'm going to do is show you how I can sit back and go to this Wi-Fi file sharing. And I'm going to work my PC. I'm going to work my PC and send some content over to does it do so again this is what i'm gonna do i'm gonna hit the home button right hit the home button go back up in here and you see that i have you know um the last one that i added was better call sal all right i added something for my wife all right so hold up let me do this again so i can go back in Yep, so I can go back in and, all right, so here we go. First thing you want to do, go over to the right side. So when you're looking at your screen, go to the right side. All right, go to the right side. You see where it says Wi-Fi file sharing? You want to click that option. So here it is. It's already on mines. All right. It's already there. I'm going to click it. And it says server. Remember, now my server, it says disabled and it's in blue. Take your remote control or whatever device you're using and make sure you highlight server. Don't click on nothing. Just highlight it where it turns blue. It turns blue. Click the right directional button so it goes over there and highlight that dot in blue. You see that? 
All right, you see it. Now you have to turn it on because right now it says server disabled. All you have to do is just click it one time. Right there is going to give you a server, a URL, the HTTP colon forward slash forward slash 192.168.1.76. But let me show you something. Remember that. Remember when I told y'all earlier? I said, remember that URL? Now, if you remember that, let me do this. All right, so let me, let's go back. Let me hit the home button. All right, let's go back in here. Let's do this. Now, remember when we went to settings? Let me show you something. Go down there to Samba server. You see that? That 192.168.1.76? That's the same number. All right? So if you ever forget, like, dang, what is it? You're going to just, I usually just write the numbers down. All right? And if I'm upstairs, I just take it upstairs with me and I leave it on. All right? Simple as that. All right? Simple as that. All right, so here we go. Let's do this. All right. Here we go. All right. We got the server on. I'm going to do what I tell y'all to do. Even though I got this number wrote down, I'm, I got my pen. All right. I got it. And so I'm going to write that HTTP 192.168. Dot one nine two one six eight dot one dot seven six was that colon one 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 one. Remember that. So all I have to do, guys, this is all I have to do. And let me do this. Uh, let me go up here. Let me take this down. Let me take that down. Let me open up a what's the name right quick. You do this, share screen. All right, there's my screen right there. All I have to do is put in that number, HTTP colon forward slash forward slash 192.168. Simple as that, 168, what's that, dot one dot seven six colon one 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 one. That's all you have to do. All right. So when you enter that, here it is. This is my Zadu one Z one thousand Pro. All right. Let me move this banner right here for a consultation. I will come back to that. All right. So. When you get here, it says internal, all right? So we're, we don't want to deal with the internal. I want to deal with nothing but my drive when I'm putting my content on there. And so I just click it right here. Now, one thing you can do, you see this? Movies, TV shows. That's it, all right? Movies and TV shows. It really doesn't matter. Or I could just send it right here. All right. Now, inside of here, because, again, I copied and paste. Right now, I ain't going to open it up. I got some stuff in there. <laughs> I got some things in there. Um, But I can just send it right to here. All right. So what I have, let me let me do this. I thought I had it open. All right. So I have two episodes. I have two episodes that I've done. As you see right here, the shy season, that's episode six and episode seven that I did. And so all I'm going to do is take both of these. Hold up. I'm going to drag them since they're TV shows. It don't matter. Uh, 
I'm going to drag both of these into the TV show section. And so, you know what? <sighs> Let me do this. Let me click on here. Because I actually have my TV shows in folders. So the shy... Let me go down here and find the shy. And here it is. Season five is right here. So what I'm going to do, and you can do the same thing, or you can just drop them. It's just to me, I keep my TV shows organized. All right. So I'm going to just take these two films. And if you got a movie, it's up to you. All right. I'm going to just take these and just go over here and drag them into season five right here. All right. From there, let me do this. All right. Let me just drop that down. Because down here at the bottom, you see where it's um, actually copying the content over. Okay. So let me do this. All right, let me do this. And now let me go into and it should be some activity up at the top. Let me hit stop screen share, stop screen. And let me make this one larger. And you see up here at the top, you see it's saying the poster. Now, remember, when I go down, Better Call Saul was the first one. But because I updated it, and it says recently added, you see it going right into the shy. All right, and it's already pretty much done. And it's going through, and that's pretty much all you have to do. Now, with TV shows, what I would do, keep your TV shows organized. Unlike movies, like make a folder that calls TV show, but when you do your TV shows, make sure whatever the TV show is, make sure you, you capture the data correctly, okay? Make sure everything is correct. You know, as far as spelling, the year it came out, what season it is, what episode it is. All right, make sure everything is correct. For movies, just keep, for the Zadu, just keep, just have a, a folder called movies. That is it. Have a folder called movies, and you can just load them in. For TV shows, create TV shows, but inside TV shows, have it organized. Create a folder and drop the folder in there, or drop the ep episode in that folder. It's as simple as that. And so now, check this out. When I go up in here, and since the shy was the last thing I added, I can go up in here, I can go to season five, and I should have six and seven. And you see six and seven is right here. All right? So you have all of this right here, and that's just how it is. That's how simple... It is to use the Explore application. It is that easy. Very, very easy. Very, 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 very easy to use it. All right. That's the beauty of it. All right. Uh, let me go up here. And again, if you have Hulu, like I have Hulu, I do have Hulu on uh, the Predator did come out today. All right. That one right there. I got it in 1080p and 4K. All right. Plan on watching that later on today. Or tonight, rather. And then I'm going to watch this one. Uh, this one look a little bit interesting. I just got it in 1080p. All right. So I will be watching that. That one look a little crazy. And then my wife, she she wanted that better call style stuff like that. So 
Oh, Dub Q say, yeah, that's the prequel to the orphan. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna get that one, but whenever they release it. What up, hustler? What's good? What is good? What's up, Clarence? Yo, Dale, I have Synology Nas and I use Video Station and Nova Player. Yeah, I, I done heard um what's the guy? Dang. The one guy, uh, he do all the NAS devices. I can't remember his name right now. But one day I'm probably going to get me a NAS device. I should have been had one. Matter of fact, I did have one, but I ended up taking it back to Micro Center like years ago. I may go that route again one of these days. Might go in one of them days. So, bro is in the building. What up, though? She said, time invested in Plex can't turn back now. Hey, I feel you. I definitely feel you. But shoot, I just like things the easy way right now. If it's going to make it easier for me, then like I, I really don't send anything to my Plex anymore because business purposes. I'd rather start like, I already got like seven devices, seven, seven households, maybe seven. That that all have their uh, the Zadu boxes in them already, so pretty cool, pretty cool. I'm gonna keep it like that because it, it's monthly income, sometimes weekly income, depending on what it is. And so every first of the month, a reoccurring comes in. Like when I did um, pray, when I did pray today. Um, and them and they all i did was put it up in the cloud text my people in total you know and they should have got it i don't know i told them it to be there for 48 hours in the google um drive cloud and so with me i'm doing it for business reasons and some of y'all can do the same thing you know we talked about it uh because honestly, you know, I think it's best that you just, you know, some people just get their own media library and go from there. But I understand, though. But I'm doing it for business purposes. I, I'm not. I like Plex, but I, I don't. Like I say, Plex, sometimes, I mean, it works. But, you know, I just don't. I, I ain't got time for it right now. I like to just be and just dump a movie on there. And I have to go, go into the login. Figure out the photo. Oh, there it goes in that folder, and then go from there. So that's just it's, it's personal preference for everybody. But I feel you. I hey, I started it all over. That's just how it was. I was like, forget that, you know. But I was like, forget that, forget that. Real is up in the building. Uh, who else? Show enough say, yo, the hammer waiting in the back. I'm not here. <laughs> uh seeing who else is up in this joint. G Torres say, What up, Super Dale? What up, though? Dale, in order to start my media library, I would need to get my own storage as far as um, a flash drive. Yes, I would suggest. If you do not have a NAS, then yes, you can start with an external drive. Um, I wouldn't. I probably wouldn't start with a flash drive unless you're just trying it out and see how you like it. Uh, I would probably go with an external drive. I always tell people to at least start with at least four terabytes, minimum four terabytes. But it, it, it just depends on what you can spend. You can get a, like a, a minimum of four terabytes. They throw them on sale all the time for like between like 85 and 95 bucks um every week best buy has a four or five terabyte on sale for under a hundred dollars so i would say do that is my personal preference i would say do it um if you're really getting into it um i i got a external drive i bull crap i will go over here and um plug it i done had this bad boy over 10 years and it still work it's connected to my my neck gear right now 
is connected. Uh, my Netgear router hasn't messed up on me. It hasn't nothing. It's still working. It's only four terabytes, but it still works. And that bad boy is over 10 years old, you know, and it's still doing the job. Um, it has my karaoke on it. It has a lot. So I would say, yeah, you probably, I mean, if you just want to test the water, maybe you got like a, a 128 gigabyte. You just want to see how it is. And you can try it that way. But eventually, when you start your media library, you're going to you're going to want something that's a little bit larger, you know, and can hold a lot more content and then go from there. He hating again, hi Gail. He hating again. Told you. Uh, I already know. Well, I ain't never saw somebody that just been upset three, four years. Three years. Uh, what we got? Lady Sun got to say, I like the Prey movie. Yeah, definitely going to watch Prey. Definitely. What's up, Chris? What's good? Hustle to say, yeah, Prey was pretty good. Was Yeah, Prey was very good. Pretty cool. Ah. <laughs> uh. Rough girl. I'm almost all digital with my collection now. That's what's up. That's what's up. That is that's good. Um, and and the thing about it, once you go digital, you know, I still have so many uh, movies on DVD. I have all of my uh, superhero movies uh, on Archer HD. Um, I still, you know, on certain movies, I just want to hear the sound and everything. Um, so like all the Avengers, um, Man of Steel, um, Batman, all of those are on Archer HD. I could put it on and look, I do have it on my, uh, on my movie library, but certain uh, films, I just love it because it, it's true 4K, right? And a lot of this stuff is like compressed 4K. So that is what's up, rough girl. Proud of you. Keep it going. Keep it going. What up, URL King? What's good? G said yes. Okay, yes. I want to say my gangster flicks and kids movie for the little ones. And that, yeah, you could do that. Yeah, that's cool. Um, uh, also with that, depending on like G, you can actually you can actually set your kids up. Um, depending on really if they they're young kids, you can put their stuff on a flash drive and just put the content. And if they have the newer televisions. Just put them into the USB port and shoot, they can have it right then and there. Unless you want it to look very, very nice where they can see the, the movie posters. If they really don't care, you don't care. You can put theirs on the flash drive. And, but it does look better when you have the movie art, though. It looks a lot better. So it do look a lot better. I ain't going to even lie. And they would love it. The kids would be like, oh, you know, <laughs> the kids just love it. And so, like, when my nieces and everything come over, we go into the animation, man, they be sitting back, oh, you know, wanting to watch it and all of that. Um, blessing Super, question, each time you do a, you do schedule a recording on the Cloner Alliance, you have to always configure at NTFS or you just have to do it 
one at a time. You have, hold on, say you have always, hold up. Each time you do schedule a recording on Cloner Alliance, you have to always configure at NTFS or you just have to do it one time. It depends if you unplug your device. If you unplug your device, then yeah. But if you want a reoccurring uh, re recorded, like say you want to record the news, you can actually set it up to record every day. All right. It should already be set unless you're unplugging that bad boy. I think once you unplug it, you just have to go in there and and put your settings back on and with your time schedules. Um, it does do that. It will lose um, what you have set if you unplug it or if you have a power outage. So if you at work, that's the only thing about it. Um, and that's pretty much any device that's like this. If you if it loses power, it's not it's going to lose everything. All right, it's not it's not built into uh, into the device, you know, like a real cable box. You know, a real cable box, once you set it up and it's, you know, it's done, it's supposed to, uh, once it power back up, even if it missed the schedule, the, the very next day, it should be back on settings. Unfortunately, these devices, if it lose power, yeah, you're going to have to do it. But if not, you don't have anything to worry about. Um, you can format it any type of way you want, you know, using the XFAT or the NF, the NTFS. I think mine is set at NTFS because they will let you record like four hours on one file compared to if you use anything else, it'll break it up like every 20, 30 minutes or something like that. Can't remember exactly the, the exact time, but forget that. I want one file and that'd be and you know that to be it. So you shouldn't have to configure it all the time. But if you're gonna do re like every day at 12 o'clock noon, you wanna re you know, you wanna uh uh record the news or a TV show or a game show, family feud, you know, judge masters or something like that, you can set it up for daily record and it shouldn't it should not be um unless you lose in power it should not be offsetting your 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 settings it should not be uh kicking your settings off all right so it shouldn't they say i love the um, portability and physical media is important because they are making changes to those movies. What up, though, Eugene? What's good? What up, though, Huff? What's good? Say, out in the field working and watching. Hey, be safe out there, Huff. Victor salute to Huff. Huff is the branding king. That cat brands everything and that's what's up because branding is is important because people i'm telling you branding is important so it's nice this is important we got a troll in here that that one is a troll <laughs> That's what's up. So definitely, that's what I'm. Um, let me go over here and look at something right quick. Plex is still leading. Damn, Cody ain't getting no love. Hey, Y'all, hey, I feel you on Cody. Ain't nobody got time. One thing I can say, um, there is nothing like getting your own content, man. There is nothing like getting your own content it makes life so much easier so much better so much better so it just it, it it makes it so much better i am working on something else 
um, I'm not going to display it this time because I'm going to do a dedicated video for you. All right. But I will not display it this time. Some of y'all know, some of y'all may not know, but it's going to bring some attention. Um, I'm going to bring some attention because a lot of apps are very, very similar. Okay. A lot of apps, very, very similar. Excuse me. A lot of apps are very, very similar, and you may not know when you get these devices. Yeah, I do the same thing. I only set mine once, and it, it does what it does. Gene said, all oh, good. Oh, got him, huh? Okay. <laughs> That's what's up. That is what's up. So, Lady Sun Goddess, did you understand that? Did you? I just want to make sure everybody do, does. Everybody understand how to share uh, or how to add to their device. Even if you're using the NVIDIA Shield, do you know how to add? Did everybody understand the Wi-Fi sharing portion? Mike says, hey, I got my own content. I love it. I use Plex, Nova Player, and DLNA. Absolutely. A lot of people don't know that they can use that DLNA. I'm gonna have to start doing some videos on it. Maybe. I hope everything good with you and your family, big homie. What up, though, LB? What is good? She says, "Yo, I'm trying to work it now. It's just real simple. It's not hard to do. All right, and I, I'll give you another demonstration on it. All right." Let me do this. The main thing, and I'm I'm not going to do the full process, but I am going to give you a demonstration. You know, um, and then go from there. Yep, and then go from there. All right, Lady Sun Goddess. All right, so here we have it, Lady Sun Goddess. So always remember, all right, on the left side, on the left side, you, you will see internal storage. That is everything that comes with the device, all right? Everything that comes with the device. If you see something that says unknown or maybe has your name or your hard drive, you will see it right here. No need to worry about root. No need to worry about app manager. This this has nothing to do with either one of those. All right. All you want to do is go on the right hand side. All right. You want to go all the way down. I'm going to just shut this down right quick. When you go on the right hand side, you just want to keep going till you get to the option called Wi Fi file sharing. Always, that's where you want to go. You want to click Wi Fi file sharing. You want to go down because yours is probably going to be just it's going to be disabled. So when you click on Wi Fi file sharing, go down one, just go down one where that whole line is blue. It's going to say disabled. You want to click the right hand, the right directional pad, just go over to the right. Click that button. 
when you click that button, it's a little dot that's on the left-hand side. It's going to turn green. So when you click it, you see that? It turns green. When you turn it off, it's off. When you click it, you see how that green button comes up, that green dot, and you turn it off. But you want yours on, so turn it on, and then from there, you see it says server, and it gives you the HTTP colon slash slash one whatever your the URL is. That's when you go, you take, write that number down, write that number down, and you take it to your computer. So say if you're ripping all of your movies to that computer, all right? You ripping everything, you have all of your files. All you have to do is what? Put that URL inside of of your um, put it inside of let me do this let me just make sure alright so all you have to do let me do this let me share share the screen so once you get that number alright so I'm going to do this I'm going to shut this one down all right, and let's open it back up. So you take that number that I just, that that your Wi-Fi sharing is giving you. All right, whatever it is, you go over here to the top of your, whatever, you, Google, whatever you're using, Firefox, it doesn't matter. All you have to do is put in HTTP colon forward slash forward slash and then you got to put in one nine whatever it is all right just put it in nine six to seven six uh one 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 you see it right here all right so when you click on it oops i must have did something wrong http colon four five four slash uh one nine two dot one six eight dot what's that one dot seven six seven six colon what's that one 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 all right and there it is right here so when you go in there now it, it looks intimidating the first thing i want you to do is go up to the top where it has internal storage, I need you to go over to the left side. I need you to collapse this. Basically, close this option. So you click that. You close it. Over here on this blue indicator right here, this little blue um, triangle that's pointing to the right. And whatever this is, if you only have one drive connected, it's usually going to be this one. Now, check this out. I'm going to plug a drive up right now, and you're going to see another one pop up right here. All right? Just to show you that you can, you know, just in case y'all have anything connected, you're going to see another one pop up in there if it's connected. All right, so on this computer, I'm gonna hit cancel, and there it is right here, because it's showing up on my screen saying, hey. So it's showing up right there. So probably let me do a refresh. And there you have it. I refreshed it, and now I have a second drive, which is right here. All right. So if, I'm just showing you an example. So it will read all of your drives. Now check it out. I'm going to pull this little flash drive out. It's right here in my hand. I pulled it out. And then I'll just refresh it again. And it should only have one drive. So you see it right here. So you know which drive you have in there. And again, 
you collapse this one. So don't do the internal. You want to do your drive. Whatever the name of it is, if it come up as unknown, or it should give you some letters and stuff. That's all you have to do is just collapse it, and then you will see everything that you have on that drive. And all you have to do is drag your content over in whatever folder. So you can select the folder you want, all right, like TV show, movie. You can select whatever you want. You know, it's up to you. TV show. So, like, if I want TV show, I can and just add my stuff to the TV show. Or I can just sit back and add it to my two movies, my folders. And then I don't, I just put everything in movies now. This is when I used to, like, put Marvel and all that together. Forget that. Since I'm using the Zadu, I drop everything into the movie folder. That's where I drop it at, right there. Simple as that. All right? And I just drag and drop it. You know, I don't, I used to separate, this is when I used to do all the separation. But once I found out, because the thing about it, there is content in here. All right? So if I click on this, you'll see all of my films. All right? All of this is 4K, Batman versus Super Superman. Avengers, Black Panther, all of that is in there. All right. But again, I'm not, I just do nothing but movies. So when I click on the movies, it'll go up in there. I don't get that. All right. So it's really up to you not to confuse you or anything, but it, it comes down to you and what you want to do with it. Also, you can actually watch your movies on your PC, all right? You can watch it. You can sit back and be like, okay, and this is another way that you can watch some movies. So say if you ripped your movies, right? I'm going to just go into the movie folder, and I'm going to go up into the movies, all right? And check this out. I'm going to just click on one. I'm going to just go down and just click. Just click on this one. It would download it and everything. It's pretty neat. But you can actually watch your content. I'm not going to take a chance. This sucker. You see how it's delaying? I ain't going to take a chance. But you can do some things with it. That's that's pretty much it. You can do some things. But this is all of your content. All of your content is right here. So it's just up to you whether you want to do it or not. However you want to set it up. It's as simple as that. Very, very easy. Very, very easy. But that's the main thing. That's all you're doing is turning on the server on your Zadu, taking that URL, going to your computer, putting that URL up here, and just putting it, and you will see it. And again, if it come like this, and it says internal, and it's just like this, open it up. If it come like this and it says internal, just click on it. You can collapse it because all you worried about is your drive. All right? And then you can just collapse it. It's simple as that. Very, very easy. Very, very simple and easy. And then you just, like I said, when you collapse it, it's just up to you where you want to put your content. You know, where you want it. And that's, the, that's what you want to figure out. And it's simple as that. It's not hard. Honestly, it's not. It looks harder than what it is. But once you do it once, you ain't got to worry about it because you would know what to do. And again, if you got your content on, let me just show you this. Let me see. I'm a, just. This is just demonstration purposes. All right. I'm going to go over to, let me go into my internal. I'm going to my internal. All right, I don't have anything in my pictures. All right, so what I'm going to do, let me go and grab some pictures. I'm gonna just drag it, and you're gonna see me drop this in the picture folder. All right, 
And then you're going to notice picture down here is going to change. See, picture just added something to it. I'm going to add the easiest way. And again, this is just, you use your external drive. I'm using this one, all right? Uh, I'm going to use this in pictures. And it's going right on over there. I use this. All right? So check it out. All right? So let me do this. I don't want y'all seeing just in case. All right, let me get that. So now let me bring this back up. I can shut this the stop screen down. Let me do this right quick. So remember, I send everything to my 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 pictures to my internal, right? And so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go up in here into the files. And so just remember. All of your files, this is your, your movie collection. This is your music. Of course, you got apps, and then you got your settings, all right? I'm going to go over here to the files. Click on that. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to storage, and I'm going to go down here to where it says pictures. Click on pictures, and these are the pictures that is on my device. And so I got this, right? All right. And so I'm going to go over to the next one. All right. And so these are all my pictures that I added. As simple as that. And then I can just go right back, you know, and then do that. Let me see something, though. Look at that. So I could turn it upside down. So if I hit the down arrow button, I could turn it upside down. But if I go left to right, it'll go to the next picture. So if again, I want to turn it upside down. I can. Crazy, but I can do it. All right. So that's pretty neat. Uh, I'm trying to see. So let me do this. I'm going to hit the back. I can copy. I can paste. I can cut. I can do add it to my favorites. I can refresh. I can rename it. New shortcut viewpoint settings and stuff like that. So I can do all of this if you want to just get rid of some stuff. But uh, it's really up to you. All right. It's really up to you however you want to do it. So you can play around with this. If I wanted to add music, you could do the same thing. All right? Pretty, pretty neat, though. Pretty, pretty neat. That's why I like this device, because there's so many things you can do. And again, this is the Z1000 Pro. So Yoza do may look a little bit different, but they all do the same thing. All right? Again, if I want to go to my movies, that's all I have to do is go right here. And I go all the way to my collection. And then just get everything right here. I want to see all my movies. This is the whole collection. All right. This is it right here. This is what it's all about starting your own library. This is what it's all about. This is what it is all about. You can't tell me this don't look good. And again, when you make your library, when you build it, it is amazing. 
you see it, man, there is nothing like it. You ain't got to wait on nobody. You don't have to do nothing. All right? You don't have to do nothing. Ain't nothing worse than waiting on somebody, man. I hope they got it in there. Or you have to click a bunch of links. Here, we we don't do that. We rather have it and then just go from there. All right. So this is the media library on the Zadu. And it's as simple as that. All right. Everything is, is pretty good. Um, and then you just go from there. All right. And same goes if I go back and I go into TV show. All right. And so you could do your TV shows the same way and go from there. Like if I go into the wire, it'll give me all five seasons, the movie art and everything. Simple as that. You know, them, all the season, they only got one season. But you see how it is. We own this city. All right. That as well. That's my dude right there. That is my guy. I like the way that cat act. So, again, you can go from there and just, you know, Bel Air. All of that. Different episodes. But that's how it is. This is the difference between... Just adding content to your Zadu compared to having to set it up. But for free, you're going to work a little bit harder. Uh, when you pay, you're going to just you'll just be able to just drop it in. So it's all good. Whichever way you go, it doesn't really matter. It's really up to you. All right. What up, though? What's good? What is good? Hustler on here talking smack. What up, Odell? What up, though? He's, he's on my computer. When I put the numbers in the box, doesn't, doesn't, hold up. When you put Dale on my computer, when I put the numbers in the box, are you putting it in the box or are you putting it up at the you putting it in the search engine? That's what you don't want to do. You're gonna have to go to like the where you put the website in, not in the box. Don't do it in the box. All right, so let me show you this. You never want to do it in the box. All right, you never want to do it in the box. Don't do it right here, right? Don't do it right here. You want to do it up here where you put the URL in. You want to do it up here. Don't do it in the little box right here. That's a no-no. So however you got your computer set up, you want to put it right there. All right, up here. Again, when you put it right here, it's not going to do anything. That's all it's going to do. All right? You don't want that, all right? You want to just, when you put it on, like if Google is your search engine, you want to go up here to the top and put your HTTP here. Don't put it down here or you're going to get this, all right? You're going to get that. So just making sure, just, just let it be known that it'll go right here, all right? And that's when you'll put it right there, all right? Of course, mine's is off right now, so just just know that. All right. Definitely smash that thumbs up. Definitely smash that bad boy. What program am I using for my library? 
I am using a device called the Zidu. Um, it's called Zidu Z1000 Pro, but that's a more expensive um, device. Um, Zidu's you can find on Amazon. It does everything for you. Um, Corey, it does. It, it, basically, you get this device, and however you get your movie content, you know, you just get it, and you just get an external drive. Uh, you know, uh, if you're unfamiliar with Nas, you can get an external drive and put your your movie collection on an external drive, and the Zidu will read it. So this is the Zidu. This is the setup right here. And again, you know, it's very, very nice. You know, very, 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 very. So you could customize it. You can do whatever you want. You could just whatever. And then, like I say, you can go up in here and it gives you all the details of what's on here. It gives you the movie trailer that automatically starts in the top right hand corner, which you're probably about to see if I don't move it. Um, right up there where you see the Black Panther standing on that rock. So it does all of that for you. And it gives you a synopsis of the movie. And then you can just go from there. But it's pretty, pretty neat. You know, very, very nice. And as you see, the trailer just started. So I'm not going to play the trailer on this. But it doesn't matter. Whatever movie it is, like Boys in the Hood, right? If I click on Boys in the Hood, just pay attention to the top right-hand corner. And Zadu goes out and get the movie trailer. So you can just sit here and just wait on it. Some movies play um, faster. Well, some trailers play faster than some. So it will. But y'all see what, what hat Cube is wearing, right? <laughs> Y'all see that hat. <laughs> and if you want to go to the trailer, you can also do it. It automatically does it, but you can also go right there. And you see it right there. It just pulled it up. You know, so that's the beauty of it. Corey said, I wanted to make a, a library that just streams over local network with no internet. Have you ever done that? I heard. Uh, so you want to. With, with without no internet, the only device that would do that would do that without no internet, you would have to get a device called uh, this one is called the new Q. I don't know if you can see it. Uh, it's called the new Q. You don't need no, you know. This is what it's called. New Q, you can get that on Amazon. I think it's like $70, maybe $80. And here it is right here. It comes with its own dedicated um, um, uh, router, everything like that. But you can get an external drive, and you can just plug your external drive right up to this bad boy, and you can share your, you know, without no internet. You don't need internet, right? You don't need internet. Um, and you can share it across your network as well, up to five devices. Um, you can use something like that. Really, if you don't have any internet, because uh, in order to, um, or you could just get, I mean, what you say, you want to you wanna stream over, hold up, you say, I wanted to make a library that just streams over local network with no internet. Have you ever done? So yeah, you could, you could do it. You could do it. Or you could just get you in a, I mean, I don't know how many televisions or devices you plan on using. Uh, or you could just get a dedicated external hard drive, put your content on there, and plug it into the back of your television. If you have a modern television with a USB, that's been going on like the last eight years. If your TV is like seven, eight years, it should work. If you got a brand new television, it's definitely going to work because it's going to read all formats mp4s it's going to read uh, uh mkvs um some televisions not all some uh will read uh do they they read uh uh impact two um i don't know if the televisions are reading isos 
I'm not familiar with that one. So if you get you an ISO image, um, I don't know if a television, but as long as it's MKV, MP4, all the regular formats that's out there, um, it'll read. You know, if you got a brand, a newer television, I ain't gonna say brand one, but a more modern television, you should be good. Yeah, we talked about that earlier, great tape. Yeah, we talked about it. I already got it, though. I got it. I showed it earlier. You said, I tried that. It just keep taking me to search. No box comes up. I don't know what's going on with your computer then. Uh, you got to have something. It got to be. No, I ain't going to even say a firewall because I got firewall. It got to be. It might be your computer. I don't know. How old is your computer, lady sun goddess? I don't know. Maybe you got some got to be your device because anybody who I ever showed it to whether they using a Chrome, anything it worked. And I know it worked on Chrome, so I don't know if you got access to a Chrome. Try it on your phone. It, see if it worked on your phone. Go into the search browser on your phone and see if you can pull it up. Let me see. Let me do this right quick. What time is it? 8.43. Let me do this. I'm going to see if I can pull it up. 192. What's that? 168.1.76. What's that? Colon 1111. Oh, shoot. Man, y'all just don't know. It was a long week. One, six, eight. One. I don't know. I don't know if it's going to work on my phone. It ain't working on my phone for whatever reason. So I don't know why it ain't working on my phone, but it definitely worked on my Chromebook. I'll tell you that now. You say kind of like the same as using the IP to a sex files uh, from another computer. I heard you can do it. The program called Jellyfin. Yeah, you probably can do it. I wouldn't know about that one, Corey. Uh, I'm not familiar with it. I never used Jellyfin. Um, the only two I use, I tried Envy. I ain't really care too much for it. Um, I tried Plex, and also I tried uh, Zadoo. And I tried this new Q device. So those are the ones... I tried. I do know with the new Q, I don't need any internet access because it comes with it built in. Um, it has its own server. Um, so that's on. That's the thing about that. So I don't know. I'm not familiar with it. I use devices mostly at the time. So. Yep. So. I'm not familiar with all of that. A lot of times, like I said, the only thing about, um, like I said, I mean, there's so many different ways you can use it, so many different ways that you can get your content. I'm just, look, I whether you have internet or not, you know, I'm a device guy. And also, I carry, like, certain things, like if I go out of town or I go on vacation, it's just certain I just carry my media. I just don't trust the internet anywhere else. My pops always call me 
while I'm online. Hold up. Let me see. Watch this. What up, though, Dad? What's up, son? You all right? Yeah, I'm good. What's good with you? Oh, um, that was that's uh, um, Junior and Jaden um school. Yeah, that's their school uh for football. That's that. That's what that is. I got that same text. Yeah, they doing. They basically, you know, how the football programs they be trying to raise money and stuff like that. So that's all that is. They got to have it in. Shoot. They want it as soon as possible, but it don't matter. It, it can go in next week, the following week. Uh, basically, they would like to have it before the season start. I think it's like, shoot, like two and a half weeks before the season start. And so I still got to get you that um that schedule. I'm going to just okay. make you a physical. I'm going to make you a physical paper because I know you don't be reading no text messages or nothing. <laughs> you old school. <laughs> well, um, well, I don't know, I don't know when I'll see it. I'll get ready to say, give him $20 for me. I'll give you $20 back. All right. Yeah, I can do that. Yeah, when we bump into each other, that's cool. You let me know where you be at tomorrow, or I'll, uh, I'll meet up with you. Yeah. Thanks, yeah. Yeah, I'll let you know. I'll let you know. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> you going to Franklin, too? Yeah, both of them at Franklin. Oh, okay, then. Yeah, sure. it's at Franklin. Yeah, both of them. That's, yeah, that's where you go to the games and see them. Franklin, both yeah, of them. I, I, know, man. I, I know Cordell go to Franklin. I didn't know he went to Franklin also. Yeah, he started last year. He going into his sophomore and Cordell would be a senior. Okay. Yeah, so. Well, put $20 in his hand, and I'll get with you and give you $20 back. Okay. All right. Okay, then, sir. Okay, I'll just wrap with you later. Okay, then. All right, Dad. Okay, then, sir. All right. I told you, man, my pops call me every time I'm live. All the time. Hey. <laughs> oh, man. Be hitting me up like, yo. <laughs> My pops. He be hitting me up like, yo. Uh, so. Where else? Hey, what y'all doing? Chilling? About to get up out of here in a second. Just a little bit. Lady Sun got to say, yo. I would just keep trying different things, but nothing is working so far. Thanks anyway. Did you say what computer you had? I don't know. I don't know. That's strange because that, that bad boy, I don't know why it's not letting you get on. You might have to just go the old school way. This right here, <laughs> these never fail. Get you a flash drive. You might just have to go. And, and do it the, the older way, but these work well too. Just just drag and drop. Put your flash drive in your computer. All right, we're gonna just say this is your computer. Put your flash drive into your computer. Your computer is gonna read your flash drive, right? Open up that window of your flash drive. Drag and drop. Once it's done, eject it the correct way. All right. Some of y'all don't know how to eject. I better not be saying that like that too much. But the proper way to eject, all right? J-Mac, boy. Why, why do J-Mac come to my mind, all right? Because he, he'll be on there like, what you say? All right. So the proper way, uh, when you, you go down, you know, on some of y'all computers, where it has your hidden icons, you just go down here and hit safely remove hardware. All right? Don't just be getting up in there just pulling it out. All right? 
Some of y'all, I already know what some of y'all thinking, because y'all, y'all think, well, I think I got the humor. So don't don't be just, you know, you got to eject out and don't be pulling out. If you pull out, if you just taking it and pulling out, yeah, eventually it's gonna be some problems. Do it, protect yourself. And do it the right way. <laughs> protect yourself. Protect your device. Input it correctly. Eject it correctly. Pull it out. And then take it and insert it into another one. All right? And then go from there. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. <laughs> hey, Thomas, you see where this is going? <laughs> Oh, man. See, y'all just, look at this. See this? Look at real. Boy, I tell you. Gail looking like, oh, shoot. <laughs> hey, hey, why you be hating on six minutes? The king of the jungle go 30 seconds and get all the respect. <laughs> I, guess, I guess, hey, listen. At least my six minutes is with a woman <laughs> and not one of my limbs, right? <laughs> I guess it's, <laughs> you know, I don't have to do this when I'm done. <laughs> I ain't got to do that, right? <laughs> Some people oh, you got to wipe off, like go and wash your hands and stuff. You got to. Uh. So <laughs> that's how it is. Uh, <laughs> I, I go get mad at six. Anybody, I don't care if a cat is going two minutes. How you go get mad at that cat? It be two minutes. Gee, you just hey. Six, seven minutes is better than using these, right? Using your paws. <laughs> See, this is meant for keeping the cat up off of you, right? Boom. 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 Not J-Mac. <laughs> J-Mac. J-Mac do this. He grab. <laughs> he goes J-Mac. He opens it up. And he get real mad if it's low. If he do this and nothing come out, oh, he mad. And then he do this. <laughs> get it nice and moist <laughs> where his hands become soft. Then he go to work. <laughs> he goes to work. And then he be like, oh, man, God. Ah, but it's all right, J Mac. <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. You'll be all right. <laughs> you, I ain't messing with this cat, man. I know he want to come on. I'm gonna invite. Hey, let me invite this cat on. Come on on here, J Mac. Tell the people why you get down. <laughs> Hey, if you got the kitties, move the kids out because J-Mac is going to come on. <laughs> He's going to show you which lubricant he uses. <laughs> we'll give him a good five minutes on here. Let's see if he show up. <laughs> well, I don't know why they... I don't know why they trying you show enough. <laughs> Gail, that's why he be so mad. He be snapping on us in the background. He be all, I be like, man, will you get you a woman? Damn. We be like, J Mac, what you watching? What you mean when I'm watching? Can't you see my TV? <laughs> Can't you see my TV? Like, uh, no. Can't see. Because you got a piano behind you. See here he go. This dude, <laughs> this dude right here. What you got on your mind, J Mac? Hey, I'm sitting here 
Just watching TV, watching you, watching the chat. <laughs> Where your TV at? It's behind the piano. <laughs> <laughs> it's on your other shoulder, man. The other shoulder. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you got that form right. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all see J Mac? He say, "Oh yeah, it's right here." That, that's how you roll dice. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, what up, though, bro? What's up, cat? How you doing, man? The uh, video was good, man. I sat here and took me some notes too. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. I mean, hey, listen. One thing about it, though, you know, like we always tell everybody, it's all about personal preference. Right. We don't force it on you, but we actually put the information out here, mm -hmm. and so. There's more than one way. Like you see Lady Sun Goddess, she say Dell is not working for her, right? Right. Then she just got to go back to the old school way. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Last drive. Right. Now, this will never fail you because that's all you got to do is just put your content on this. And you may have to get up and just plug it in and just copy everything over. It's as simple as that. Remember, that's what I used to do back in the day. I'd be like. Then while I'm upstairs, uh, if I'm upstairs, I don't be feeling like coming down here and doing. I was like, man, you know what? Let me. Once I got playing with the um, the Explorer app, I was like, oh man, it's over. Because <laughs> you could do your copying in there. You can create a zip inside the Explorer app, which I'm gonna show y'all that as well. I'm gonna show y'all that as well. How to. Uh, how to uh, uh, create a zip with your with your applications? Mm -hmm. I didn't know that, huh? Hey, you can send it and then just go from there. You know that other project you told me about? Which one? Oh, oh! Okay, look, I already filled one of these up already. Damn! <laughs> I'm just hey, I'm just waiting. Hold on, let me see. Hey, look, Jay, hold up. Watch this, Jay. Okay. Let me do this. I, I got something for you, too. Oh, I've been working. <laughs> I've been working. I'm going to just add this to it as well. I got something. I don't know if you can see it. I don't know if you can I, see I, it. I, I think I can make it out. I, I think I can you, make it you, out. You, you, you think? <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, I got a strong idea, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Only if y'all knew. <laughs> look, 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 this is the question. This is the question. Are you only giving them forty-eight hours to look at it? <laughs> um, no, that's that's gonna be another service. Okay, got gotcha, you, got gotcha, you, got gotcha. you. You already know where I'm going with it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm listen. I'm not playing with them. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's gonna be another service, yeah. and uh, and then we just go from there. Right, but I am gonna um actually that folder was called the ground. The who? The ground. <laughs> <laughs> it was called the grown folk, right? <laughs> Check it out, J Mac. Uh huh. Let me back out. You see that option right there? <laughs> yeah. <Yo. laughs> oh, this dude. This dude. I refuse to click on that bad boy. Oh, heck no. <laughs> hey. He showed up the grown. <laughs> Coming to a special near you. Hey. You you see the hawk, right? Yeah. <laughs> you see the <laughs> I know where you're going. <laughs> I would not open that up if I hey not on YouTube. No, mm -hmm. no, no. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Not on YouTube. No, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. They say mm -hmm. click it down, click it. Mm -hmm. No, no, no. You no, know what no, no. <laughs> you know what you do? You send that, you send a couple of them to LJ while he's sitting in the doctor's office. Or or in in church, and say it's a it's you got to see this LJ you got to see this. Hey, I ain't about to have LJ knocking over lamps and stuff at the doctor's <laughs> office. 
Jeez. <laughs> I'm talking about, uh, I'll be right back. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, so yeah, man, it's just crazy, man. But that's why I say, man, it's all type of ways you can use this to your advantage. And, and just, um, <laughs> he's a, he's a, hell no, don't do that to me. Not at you. you already got him in trouble once with the Lord, man. I, look, if, if you get a message, are you forced to turn that message on? Yes. <laughs> Yes, this guy got LJ in trouble at church. I did not. This guy. <laughs> can I say, Dale, I was asking uh, you a question about Zadu Media Player, if you can access it outside your home network. There, I have saw someone um, do it, because I am on like probably about three to four, or um, like Zadu um, pages um, on Facebook. I am on like three to four of them, right? And the thing about it, um, um, there was one guy. I don't know how he ported it out. I don't know. But he actually shared his Zadu outside of his home network. He said it took him some time, but he got it. He said he was going to drop a video, never did. I haven't saw, at least I haven't came across it. But yet there is a way, but, you know, that that be for them IT guys. Them guys be knowing all type of ways how to do things um, and then go from there. Um, so uh, I don't know. I haven't tried it because I, once I leave my, once I, if I want to watch something, really it, it's very rare I'm going to watch anything outside my 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 network. I mean, my home. Like if I go out of town, I know how to get my external hard drive, and I have a device right here that I know that's guaranteed going to work without internet. One thing about it, you need in in order to get your content, all right. In order to get your content, you have to have um, good internet. Like, or you're going to have to have your stuff already downloaded within Plex. But what if I get somewhere and I want to watch something else? Like, somebody, you might be with somebody and say, hey, you know, I want, can we watch this? Well, if the network and your internet is not good and you didn't already um, download it for um, um, without the internet, all right, it's not it's not sitting there waiting for you, and there's no way you can get it. <clears throat> so, I just it's just certain things I do because I don't want the issues. So, like when we went to Chicago, we didn't have any issues. All right, everybody, I had everybody connected, and I put so much what everybody wanted, and everybody was watching different things. But I do know, like if we would have been on. Plex, which I done been on at the uh, at the airport. I was on my Plex at the airport, and it wasn't a it, it was it played, but it was pausing and because you got so many different networks going through there, mm -hmm. it wasn't as pleasant as it would have been at home. But when I had this device, I didn't get not one. I got one hiccup. I got one hiccup, and that's when we went through. Um, we went through. Uh, we went. We was in Gary, Indiana, because ninety four was messed all up. So we went through Gary, Indiana. We went to some part, and wherever we was at, it was a bunch of trains, and it was like an industrial area. Mm -hmm. All of us got a hiccup for like a good five seconds, but they had all of these like. Uh, what you call them things? Uh, uh, power. What's the the power things that they be using now? Um, what is it? Uh, J Mac. You know, like the like the energy company. All these solar panels. Yeah, solar panels. They had a bunch of solar panels and things like that. And wherever we, it was in Gary, Indiana. 
whatever what they was doing over there because uh 94 going west was super super crowded and so i told my wife I was like forget that you know let's come up and go around this and when we went through this little industrial area a bunch of buildings old buildings uh and a bunch of solar panels in gary indiana mm. and um train tracks all of that it was it was a lot over there and yeah, it, and it just hiccup for one. I don't know what you know. I'm quite sure I know what what caused it because right. it was a lot of like metal and solar panels, all type of things like that. So that's the only thing. But I don't know how to set up set it up um, to actually share out the network. So I can't answer that one, Clarence. Mm -hmm. Seeing. LJ got his uh, bullseye going on tonight. Yeah, yeah, you know they. Mm -hmm. You know how they be. <laughs> yeah, you know how they be. So you got some some uh, business tomorrow morning? Yeah, I got some business tomorrow morning, early in the morning. I'm going to get down. Uh, definitely about to get down and do this uh, consultation, mm -hmm. helping people start their, their media library. And then just go from there. Um, I'm hands on with it. For the last, like, what? I know the last two weeks has been like book, it's been full. So mm -hmm. far, it's looking like that. So if you want to start your 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 media library, you know, uh, you know, you want to learn how to start it, so you can. Maybe you want to start a Plex. Maybe you about to order you as a do. Um, um, I think so far I got uh, at least. What like three people? No, three, four people. Um, that's already confirmed. Mm -hmm. I had like six emails. It's probably more than that now. Six or seven emails that I got to go through and see who else and add them to the list. And so I get up early and and get down. Shoot, I be up at seven seven thirty in the morning. J Mac, just what's up? that's what's up. Do my thing. And mm -hmm. yep. So the hustle be real. And I, I and and like I said, I just like when people are able to do what they do and, and be able to save money and time and, and see what they're creating. And you know, and the the one thing I like when you talk about it, people don't have to depend on those other apps that keep going up and down. You got yeah. your own stuff. Oh uh, yeah, this my micro center guy right here. Hold up just a second. Uh -oh. What up though, Ben? What's up, bro? Nothing, man. Got you on YouTube right now. <laughs> you. Yeah, you you on there? You know I do these live shows. Okay, for sure. Yeah, yeah I see. Yeah, um, I'm ready to do that that one on one, bro. Yeah, go go to my um, go to the channel. Just email me so I can um, I can put you on the list. Okay. And then we can go from there. So email me, and I'll send you everything, um, in the email back that you're gonna need. What that I would like you to have that way it make it very, very easy. So yeah, just go just go to the video. You'll see my email up. Matter of fact, it's on the screen right now. Just okay. just send me an email and then you working tomorrow? I'll be there tomorrow. I'm I'm, I'm there from eight thirty to like tomorrow, five thirty. Oh, eight thirty to five thirty? Yeah. What time do you usually get up? I'm getting I'm I'll probably might get up at <laughs> about six. About six. Shit, we might have to do I mean, if you want to do it tomorrow, we may have to do an early one. I just got to check because um, I got to check. Or we could just probably do it um, later on that evening. Okay. Yep. I'll see. I'll see what's going on. Okay. If it's, if it's late, late, I could probably do it. But if it's late, because uh, after, I, hit the, cause after uh, I get off work, I'm, 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 I'm back on the streets. So yeah. I'm, 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 still, uh, I'm still dealing with the people that's like. Like far, far behind. Yeah, yeah. Well, you definitely about to bring them up. So, uh, so I already know. I already know. I'm, I'm probably gonna be out there tomorrow too. Okay. Yeah, I got, I got to come out there and get another um external drive. So, okay. I, 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 I kick it with you though. We will kick it. All right. All right, for sure. <laughs> okay. All right, yeah. All right, no problem. All right, get in yeah. yeah. Look at that. That's what's up. Changing lives. Mm -hmm. And the thing about it, me and him, we've been kicking it for like 
Shh, it's been a minute. <laughs> We'd be like, what up, though? He'd be like, what up, though? He'd grab a sticker. Bye. <laughs> <You know? laughs> yep, that's my micro center guy right there. We, I like, we've been knowing each other like, I ain't going to say like we, we hang together, but as far as crossing paths at micro center, mm-hmm. yeah, he been there years and doing his business. So we just, I'm mean, just elevating. That's what it's all about. Take them mm-hmm. to that next level mm-hmm. and go from there. It's all about what you say. It's all about the experience. Oh, it's all about the experience. And also, <laughs> like you say, man, like we do, we, we, we sit back, man, because you never know when you might, somebody can teach you something. Mm-hmm. And that's the thing about it. I like to be taught. Yeah. You know, when it comes to this stuff right here, I like to be taught. And if it's going to make my life a little bit easier, Mm-hmm. Uh, it is what it is, you know, and uh, that's what it's all about. That's what I like, I like about, um, I'll give you a good example. Like I was out at, a, at my father's house putting his sticks and stuff together. And I lost a code, an important one that I needed. Mm-hmm. And I was like, oh, I ain't going to be able to finish this. But then, you know, then LJ and uh, Bo said, oh, you know, you can do this code this way where you got it on the go and replace it over there and download it. Mm-hmm. I said, oh, so, you know, they taught me how to do that because I, I was using another way to do a code. Mm-hmm. And that, that process gave out all together. So, you know, how we do sit back and teach each other. Shoot. Yeah. So, mm-hmm. It's all about, man. We just share ideas and and go from there. Mm-hmm. You know, that's that's you know, that's what it's all about. You know, we are. Uh, I'm always looking at ways to save money or you know, try to help someone. Right. Uh, and then we, you know, it might be a business deal, but true, once I'm done, mm-hmm. you know, you're going to take off running anyway. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, and that's what it's all about. You know, we ain't about the sugar coat. Mm-hmm. And, just, and just think about the people who, who like the all in one device where they can control stuff. And, you know, LJ always points out when the, what's that, the one boxes uh, go on sale by Amazon, the, um, Cubes. cubes. Yeah. When that goes on sale, he's like, hey, y'all, Cube is on sale. Yep. So that, that's something good to set up because you can, if you're tech savvy or somebody in your health tech savvy, you can control your house with all the devices and stuff if you choose to do that. Yep. Mm-hmm. Got you, Ultimate. I would check it shortly. But yeah, that, you're right, man. You are absolutely right. Uh, and, and the Cube is still on sale at Best Buy for 60 bucks. Mm-hmm. A very, very nice device. And the same mm-hmm. thing you do with the NVIDIA Shield, you could do it with the Cube as right. well. So as far as, you know, watching your content, again, uh, if you're setting up these uh, these media libraries uh, or you got a, a Zadu or you got a NAS connected and, and it's on your, your home network, that's all you need is an application called Nova Video Player. Mm-hmm. And just go to Go to network and pull that content. Go to network, find the name of your server, whatever you named it, it's up to you. Like y'all saw me with Big Boy. Mm-hmm. Don't know why I called it Big Boy. I just called it Big I think I was, I don't know. I was like, man, Big Boy. You know, and um, I probably went past the restaurant. Mm-hmm. Probably what I did. <laughs> and um, just named it. You can name it. I mean, there's so many ways, so many things you could do. It's just right. really up to you, though. This really comes down to you. But uh, get that cube. I think that cube is a very, very nice device um, to use. Yeah. Honestly, I believe so. It's very, very nice. Now, let me ask you this. I, I, I think you, either you have done it or you haven't done it in a while. Or can you get, can you do it in the future? Like, take each device, the popular devices that we all use, and put them side by side. To let people see what they are, like mm-hmm. how you usually do, and just say, "Hey, this does this, this, and this. This one may not have this. This one might not have that. Is this one going to fit what you want as far as budget-wise? Watching 4K. Have you? Did you do a video like that before? I've done a video like that. I was just thinking about doing another video because I just noticed something today. I bull crap you not. Now you know, uh, over a week, a couple weeks ago, I used the Fire Stick. Mm-hmm. I had the fire stick using Nova Player. Mm-hmm. I think, and I listen, 
I did something today. I went upstairs because my wife was on. Um, she was connected to my my other server that was connected to the Zadu. The other Zadu, the Z10 Pro. She was connected to that one. She wasn't connected to the Z1000 Pro. Mm -hmm. But what I did, I went up to Nova Player. I bull crap you not. Went up to Nova Player. I had my fire stick right here. Because I had my fire stick, um, I connected it to the Z10 Pro as well. Mm -hmm. I went up stairs. I went to Nova Player. I went to settings with the app. I cleared the data. I bull crap you not. Cleared the data on the um I cleared the data on Nova Video Player. I went to network, found Big Bit Big Boy, and you know, um set it up so it started pulling from the Zadu Z one thousand. I came down here. I cleared the data on this. Now, this is like three minutes later. Mm -hmm. I talked some smack, came down here. I cleared the data on the fire. This is the Fire Stick 4K Max. Cleared the data on Nova Player connected to the, Z, um, the Z1000. Dude, now all this talk. Now, I don't know what happened. Mm -hmm. I couldn't tell you. As far as getting the content that pulled quick, the Fire Stick 4K Max was done about seven minutes before the shield. And it started three minutes later. Really? As far as grabbing all that content. Uh-huh. Now, I, hey, look, I ain't the one to start no smoke. <laughs> but I got a, I got a, I got a, I got an NVIDIA shield right here. Mm -hmm. And I'm thinking about doing the live show because people really get crazy when it comes to this NVIDIA shield stuff. Yeah, yeah. Like it just doesn't have any flaws. Every device has Every flaws. Every device has a flaw. Mm -hmm. But you listen to some of these people, it's, it's, a, it's um, NVIDIA shield or nothing. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to run this test again, J-Mac. Right. And I'm telling you, it, I'm going to start, listen, I'm going to start them at the same time. Mm -hmm. Let this bad boy pull it, pull that data quicker than that NVIDIA well, shield. Right. Mm -hmm. We're going to have a problem. So you're telling me this little device that we got for $30 is pulling way faster than this NVIDIA shield. Now, right. Maybe something was going on with the shield. I don't know. Mm -hmm. But, dude, I sat back. I'm like, and it was done. I went upstairs. That sucker was, it was, <laughs> it was done. It was on, like, 300 and something. Wow. I said, what the heck? And I got, like, 900 and something, uh -huh. almost 1,000 content up in there. So I said I'm going to do it again. Okay, okay. I'm gonna do it again, and then see. Uh, the the uh, the uh, Nova um the Nova yeah, both the Nova is gonna be playing. Yep, both okay. of them will be using Nova Player, mm -hmm. and I'm gonna just test it out. I might even add the Zadu up in there, right? Okay. And try to do them back to back to back. I know it's gonna mm -hmm. be tough, but we'll see. We can yeah. all manage and see and see which one captured that data. Because mm -hmm. I found that kind of strange. I found it kind of strange that. The NVIDIA Shield was pulling slower than... Um, right, because that, that machine's supposed to be like yeah. that. Yeah. I know with Cody, that bad boy used to go and get that bad boy. It used mm -hmm. to be... Mm -hmm. I don't know. Maybe it was just having a bad day. Uh, it was just having a bad moment. Parker said, what version of the... What version are you using on NVIDIA? The old or the new? The um it should be on the late it's on the latest one. The yeah, nine point it shouldn't one. really matter. Yeah, mm -hmm. it is it, the nine point the last one because it does I updated it upstairs. Mm -hmm. So 
But it's crazy. She said she said the shield made changes during mass update affecting Nova Player. Really? That's crazy. Yeah. Cause you would think that because it is able to um you could connect the uh, whether you got a NAS or an external hard drive to it and it, it, you can actually share the content across mm-hmm. you know your home network it shouldn't even affect it you would think right right but that just goes to show you like the nvidia shield that's why i be telling people like you got to find that device that works for you mm-hmm you can't be listening to all these people, man. Oh, man, do this, do this, do this, shit. No, you got to find that device that works for you. Right, because you don't want nobody like, oh, I got to go spend $200. Yeah. And you find out two months, two months later, they say, hey, I could have got this $60 device and it worked just as well. Yup. What up, though, Giorgio? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's good? Yeah. you, And that's why we always see, listen. I still remember the conversation, and this ain't no knock on the guy, right? This ain't mm-hmm. no knock. Mm-hmm. You know, that's why I never go into a conversation thinking I'm about to get this guy or get someone the most expensive device. Mm-hmm. Because because you got the most expensive device doesn't mean that is it, it, with the with whoever you're doing it for is going to be using it. You know, I'm never going to tell you to get an Nvidia Shield. Right. Just to watch a third party application. You know, and that's that's me. I'm mm-hmm. never going to tell you that. And I'm not going to tell you if you're a gamer to go and get a fire stick. Right. <laughs> right. I, it's just certain things that you got to find out about your client who's who's asking you who's supposed to be the what professional. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. When we're out here. Um, hooking up these devices, selling them. We should know exactly what we need. All yeah. right. You should know, like right now, the hottest thing going is what the on boxes, right? Mm-hmm. But if you think about it, if picture if we go by picture quality. If you go by picture quality, I think the Fire TV Q picture. Is a lot more solid than the on picture. Yeah, I can see that. I can see that. You know, but I do understand if you want, and now if somebody come to me and say, hey, J Mac, they come to you, hey, I need my picture to be stunning. Mm-hmm. I got this $4,000 television. I need everything to be crispy. I'm right. not going to sell them that on box. No, uh uh-uh. uh. Mm-mm. That might be the chance for you to say, okay, let's get this up. You may, hey, listen, you got this option. Mm-hmm. There's something called a Fire TV Q. There's something called an NVIDIA Shield and everything in between. Right. You might have to go that route. Mm-hmm. Um, because not every device, listen, I got the Fire Stick and I used the same app and I saw picture quality. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. A little twenty dollar device is not gonna give you a picture like the Nvidia Shield. Mm-mm. No, it's not. No, it, it's just not. And like, like, give, give you a good example. That's like there's a there's something that LJ been waiting on for a little while now. So that's like LJ going from the device he got going to a little miniature sound box. He don't want to yeah. hear all that. Yeah, you know, it, 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 and that's why you got to listen. If you got somebody say, "Man, look, I just want to." I just be wanting to watch a movie. Right. You know, as long as it's clear, I'm good. All right. And I can say, all right, look, we can go with this on box. We can go with a fire mm-hmm. stick. Yeah. Then, uh, somebody talking about quality. Hey, man, I got Adobe Atmos. I got a, I got a whole surround sound, you mm-hmm. know. Then I know what I got to do. Right, right. You know, and I can give them some choices to say, okay, you might want to go with this. That's why I did not understand why you know individuals were saying and it's not no knock on them maybe that's just their personal preference mm-hmm. but me i can't just sell anyone a device and they're not going to use it to its full of capability right right and i think that's just why that's why the on is just so perfect for people because they a lot of people just want to watch movies mm-hmm. want to watch pay-per-view want to watch sports and then they 
it is what it is. Right. You're not going to take that alarm box into somebody's house, and the first thing you look at, they got this huge surround sound in this TV. Oh, Hell we have no. <laughs> Hell no. <laughs> uh, they gonna be, you, you see that, or they be like, yeah, man, I got this 7.2.4, all this yeah. stuff. <laughs> and yeah, my television, yeah, it's an 85-inch. I got mm -hmm. the surround sounds. I got the Dolby. I got all of this stuff. I got stuff in the ceiling, man. I need a device. Right. Uh, let me give you this arm. <laughs> You're like, what? There is a difference. And but, so uh, that's why I say, man, you got to learn them devices. Oh, yeah. To, to all the hustlers out there, learn them devices. And this is why we show you. Like, when I had people, when I showed them what I got, and people said, man, I want to do a movie collection, too. Mm-hmm. Bet. Bet. And that's what I did. Okay, you do? Mm -hmm. I got you. I got you. And what did I do? I created a, a, a avenue to generate revenue. Revenue, right. I used technology where I could sit right here, put it up there, and you got 48 hours, I'm taking it down. Yep. That's just how it is. This is how you copy. <laughs> this is how you <laughs> add to it. And then you go right back to that to do, -do, and it should be there. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's like, I heard, what was someone in the in the earlier in the chat was talking about? Um, like when you said you don't particularly use your Plex anymore because you got this, and it's you know it's easier to use the device that you have now because Plex is a lot of work. Now that is true, and people that that have both of those type of programs, why not just stop your? I forget what the conversation was. They were having trouble, maybe thinking about switching or not switching. But if you think about it, your drives are already there. Already, you already got to do is connect your drives over to the new device, which might be the does it do, and yeah. don't worry about it. Yeah, so you yeah. got the setup already done. Yeah, your setup is all it. So, like, let's just say this. Let's say you like me, Plex, right? I do have Plex. You can use that application, and you can pull from your Plex. You can pull from any server. Yeah, that's the beauty of it. You can pull for any server, and it, it it's really up to you. We, I think it's just good to have options. Right. Mm -hmm. It's good to have options, and it's just that, like I said, I just get tired of, you know, I love my Plex, but it goes I know how to move on, too, because I don't want to come downstairs every three or four days when, I'm, when I decide to sit at home or say I come out from a, a get-together and it's 2 o'clock, I'm feeling good. I'm not sleepy. Mm -hmm. And I go, <laughs> you go and grab your remote. You go to your Plex and everything is showing, right? right. And you like, you know what? I'm about to watch this movie. And it gives you that error code. Yep. <laughs> and, I, and this is the thing about it. This is what get me, j Mac. I don't know about everybody else. I love my horror films. Right. But at certain times of the year, I don't like coming down the basement without no. <laughs> There's a movie called Halloween. A lot of people lost their life in the basement. There's a movie called Blackout. It just seems like a lot of things goes on down in the basement. Not only that, what's the movie you and LJ talk about that I refuse to watch? Oh, hereditary? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You don't want to watch it, man. Good luck with that one. Good luck with that one. And how long that movie been out? It's been out, what, about two years? Probably yeah, going on I haven't watched it yet. <laughs> hereditary, that lasts 15, 20 minutes. The, the movie, you would be like, man, this is some bull crap. <laughs> and when it come to that room scene, that's when everything... She, and then granddad standing in the closet butt naked like this. <laughs> oh, I'm talking about really butt naked, dog. Yeah. Uh -huh. Like butt naked, nothing on. Head toe. He up there mm. like this. <laughs> nah, dog. Nah, dog. <laughs> no, sir. Look, I, 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 <laughs> I hey, I'm with you on that one, show enough. I ain't got a, a, I, a, a, listen, I'm not doing it. Hey, see Oliver say, 
Hey, certain <laughs> times of the year, I'm like, hey, no, man. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, I'm straight. <laughs> I am straight. <laughs> Look at real, real, real. Don't want to watch nothing. She that watch none of that. She, she ain't watch Scooby Doo. She'd be like, heck, you know. <laughs> she don't watch Scooby Doo. <laughs> oh, hey. Okay. Say I don't like it. Hey, I feel you. I love them, but it's just certain. Like during Halloween. Man, I'll be like this. Look, I'm the first one at the job every day. Mm-hmm. And you know, during Halloween season, man, it'd be dark. <laughs> and you look, look, from from October the 1st to the 31st, I'd be nervous as heck. <laughs> November 1st, I'm good to go. Right. That cat always disappear. <laughs> he disappeared for the whole year to Halloween season. <laughs> I'm like, man. <laughs> so I'll be good. Yeah, I'll be mm-hmm. good. So, hey, but check it out. Been on on two hours. I think a little bit over two, shoot, two and a half hours. Damn. Damn. So uh, I'm gonna get ready, to get up off of here. Um, do got a lot of things going on tomorrow. So, um, again, guys, if you want to get on that list that consultation right there you want to learn how to start your library i am before i even get down with you it's a it's a it's a couple things you're going to need you know before we even get started uh one you definitely gonna have to have internet all right you (laughs) if you ain't got internet you just want to use your phone you listen it look just have internet because J Mac, I did get somebody. I said, yeah, I ain't even know it. He had everything except for internet. I don't know how he was going to do it. And this is not a knock on him. But I said, well, damn. How you going? He was like, man, I'm doing that. He's like, man, I, I'm trying to save some money. I'm going to just use my phone. I say, well, good luck. Okay. Okay. I say, man, she. I said, at least turn on the hotspot on that bad boy and connect it right. to your laptop. Right, right. Look, look, look. <clears throat> All out the real. <clears throat> right. Yep, yep. <laughs> hey. <laughs> hey, GoPro. Go. Hey, so, bro, say, hey, yo, call them. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Hey, listen, one thing I can say about Mike, he'll let you punch him once or twice. You see, I mean, you got to punch him and, and be gone. Mm-hmm. Don't fall, but be gone. Mm-hmm. So I, I I got good. Hey, listen, I ain't going to lie. My first three punches, yeah, dog. <laughs> I got a good three punches in me. I'll tell you that now. And if it connect against the, if, if the fist connect against the jaw, <laughs> but then J Mac, you know what I say? If I knock you out, I'm going in the pockets. I got to go in the pockets, right? Mm-hmm. If I knock that cat out, I ain't going to nothing. I'm out. <laughs> I'm gonna see you running up the street like four. Hey, damn! Jump in the car. <laughs> Then he raise up and be like Della Reese. Oh, that's what I'm talking right. about. Oh, I'm talking about. <laughs> Mike, you talk now. Right. Oh. <laughs> you sit there and get outside, like. And look, cats always get down. They run about a mile, like. Right. Turn around, cat be right there. Right Man, there. Mm-hmm. You gonna see me running? I'm gonna be running <laughs> right down 94. <laughs> I might even run 94 to 75. <laughs> hey, be looking back like she. <laughs> look, look, like I can hear LJ talk about, you know, J Mac got a key. <laughs> hey, I'm not looking back. I'm gone. I'm not looking back. That won't be no day I look back. Like, look at him. He ain't stopping. Hey, man. Hey. Hey, I ain't stopping. I'll see you when I see you. See. And if the police come, they better just be on the side of me. Hey, man. 
Sir, what you doing? Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Sir, you go out and stop. Hey, no, man. Last time I stopped, you can't try to attack me, man. Uh -oh. Only way I'm stopping if you get out that car and I'm getting in. Because soon <laughs> something's going to happen to you, I'm pulling off. Right. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, so that's what it is. Uh, Synology, Zazu, and Buzz TV X fives are my daily drivers. Absolutely, I still got mines right here. I use them all, though. I use them all, so but absolutely. So, I say, like the guy that called me and said the stick didn't work when he got home, only to find out he didn't have internet. <laughs> I get that, I get that a lot, man. Cats that text me, yo, Dale, ain't nothing working. Mm -hmm. I say, yo, I text back, yo, <laughs> run that app called Analytics. If it says error, that's on your end. Call your <laughs> provider. Let me know. Mm -hmm. Cats don't even call me back. They be knowing like, damn. Oh, yeah, they know. They know me. Mm -hmm. yep, so. All right, guys, I'm getting up out of here. Hey. Uh, Hustler, you want to talk to the people? Hey, I just want to say thank y'all for coming in to Dell's show. Like I, you know, like we always say, he dropped some gems tonight. I know a lot of people took notes. Uh, reach out to him if you want to do your own uh, media. He got you. And it's my brother. He's doing the damn thing. Right. That's what we're doing. And listen, again, it's supposed to be like 90 degrees here. I know you, it's supposed to be about 90 in Ohio too, ain't it? Yes, it, so it rains be... all day today, but it's going to be 90 this weekend. We got a little bit of rain, just a little bit. So, mm -hmm. hopefully, y'all get that snow. Remember, y'all got that snow last time, and we didn't. Yep. Hopefully, it, it, hey, y'all can keep that snow down there in Ohio. <laughs> let, hey, let it keep going under. <laughs> no, what, what we wanted to do is go down south with LJ. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, man, they got crocodiles. Man, I'd rather deal with the snow, man. <laughs> if I can't walk down the street, right. you know what I'm saying? Crocodiles, crocodiles, and they got some geckos and all that stuff popping out I, and snakes in the grass. I ain't got time for all that, man. I'd be darned if I got to call tech every day to come get this gator out of my yard. Oh, uh, yeah. He going to fry that bad boy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I had some, some gator stew. <laughs> you see, you see, she, I had some gator stew. I made a gator pie. <laughs> She made. Then I took the other half. I took the tail. <laughs> it made. It, it made a, a a gator cheese and ham sandwich. You know. And then what he said. You could do that. I, yeah, I made some gator tail. I took the liquid from the gator. The I took the liquid from the gator and put some CBD and some Bluetooth in it. Look at me. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. He, <laughs> he's smoking the gator. Yeah, man. I'm smoking this gator. I found out there on the road. <laughs> It cures uh uh it cures uh HIV uh it cures <laughs> throwing ball <laughs> what they call it anesthesia or whatever it's called <laughs> and look it, it cures bad breath <laughs> look and then he gonna say and that made me think of my new project how right preachers, how preachers don't have to get tested no no <laughs> If you want to learn this, I got a course. <laughs> you want to learn how to kill the gator? I got a course. Follow it step by step. <laughs> hey, that course, $85, but I got right. it to you. <laughs> You order between nine and ten, you get it for fifteen. Right, it's going fast. But you see this? Uh, you see how much? And there's a weight loss too. You smoke this gator. <laughs> <laughs> I guarantee somebody gonna say, "Do you smoke it with the tail?" No, you smoke it with the head. <laughs> <laughs> the head to give you a little bit more kick. I got a course for that one too. <laughs> <laughs> You wouldn't know how to cook a squirrel. I got a course for that one too. Right. Click on that link tree. 
Is it taking all special? my courses? <laughs> Matter of fact, you give me a thousand dollars, I give you everything. Right. You get a <laughs> How to build a studio. Got a right. course for that. Right. And just because you're you, you get a chicken dinner with your plan. <laughs> when I learn how to cut gas, I got a course for that too. Right. <laughs> Change your engine. I don't do that no more, but I got a course for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But hey, look, shout out to y'all, man. We always take shots at each other. Oh, my but, God. Um, but we 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 all do our things, man. That's one thing I can say about our squad. We've been together a long time, and we still have fun doing it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And um, that you saw the listen. You pretty much seen a lot of groups go, and a lot of groups <laughs> hanging by a thread. They 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 fly away because you know it wasn't authentic, right. you know, or they just couldn't handle the pressure. Or it just became a little bit overwhelming, you know. Mm -hmm. It's one of the factors, you know. Um, YouTube is not, it's easy, but, you know, it, it, it can be challenging sometimes. So, again, you know, uh, salute to everybody. You know, um, it's not built for everybody. I encourage everybody, but at the end of the day, you got to sell yourself. And that's one thing uh, I could say about our squad, DST. Whether we do it on YouTube or we do it in the community, we get our hustle on. So, yep, yep. I mean, that's I mean, we go to the river and fill up a bottle of water, tell and sell it right to you. Mm -hmm. you know? And that's just how it is. Um, we make a profit off of. You know? So, of course, I thank y'all. I hope, hopefully, y'all um, learned a little something. I know I, I repeated this like a couple weeks ago, but I do have another video that's coming. Um, so hopefully I don't step on anyone's toes or, uh, you know, mess up any future collaborations, but at the, at the end of the day, it's all about educating y'all. That's what it's all about. Cause I'm always thinking. And again, I think next week I will let y'all know, um, on this one program, if you want to take your, your, uh, your content to another level. All right. Just like you saw uh, J Max say, he already filled the drive up, <laughs> just like that. So, you ready to do that? Uh, I think I'm gonna do that one as well, and then put it out there, and then um, share the information with you. So, mm -hmm. um, again, very, very, it's very, very, it is super. When I tell you it's extremely easy, you are gonna be like, wow, right, right. You're going to be like, wow. And again, this is only if you want to take it there or keep it for yourself. I mean, yeah. I mean it is what it is. So mm -hmm. salute to y'all. Thank y'all to everybody who donated tonight. Um, thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Um, and again, I'm going to get to these emails so I can, um, you know, uh, see what we're doing tomorrow. Again, if you want to learn how to get your, your movie library started. Um, again, send me the email right there, as you see on the screen, and I will show you how to get started. And I guarantee you, you will not look back. All right? I appreciate y'all. Love y'all. Thanks for everybody who donated. And to my, my, my business people, y'all keep doing what y'all doing. Keep getting that bread. Keep taking care of your families. Keep taking care of yourself. Also, to my sneakerheads, hmm. Jordan 5's come out tomorrow, the Concourse. I know a couple of y'all going to get them. And so, you know your boy going to have to sneak out. <laughs> sneak, slide. They already know. They already hit me up, J-Mac. Hey, Dale, you, know, you know they come out tomorrow. I said, mm -hmm. yeah, I'll be there. She say, what size you want me to put you to the side? Uh-oh. So, I, I can't say what I want to say because I know my wife is lucky. <laughs> She on. I, I don't want no smoke. <laughs> I think she went and saw a lawyer today. Oh, boy, might be getting some papers. Uh oh. <laughs> I ain't talking about the papers that tech and the bow can be using. <laughs> Say, oh, you leaving me, huh? <laughs> she said, no, I ain't leaving you. Why would I do that? I love you. 
but you know how y'all women are. Y'all, she, y'all slick. So <laughs> I know in the hey, look, I know in the, within the next week if I get some paper. Look, look, look you might know sooner because somebody in the, in the chat is a snitch. <laughs> look. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, she's like, what size you need? You want I put them to the side? I say, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Tens and halves on to the side for me. <laughs> like, man, I got you. But that's just building relationships, man. And that's what, it's about. that's what it's all about. And see, I ain't got to wait in line. <laughs> mm-hmm. I just slide in there. What up, though? They be like, what up, big fella? <laughs> I'm going to start doing my videos, J-Mac. Y'all going to see it. Y'all gonna see it. Y'all think I be playing, man? I be hey, out that's here. Hey, that's what we waiting on. That's what we waiting on, Chief. Come on with it. I be out here in these streets. Streets. <laughs> no, I'm down south. So streets. <laughs> I be out here in these streets. <laughs> I, I'm like my southern partners. I don't even say the streets no more. Hey, I be down here in the streets. <laughs> getting it in. What up, though? Yeah, man, they, she one of the managers even gave me forty percent off. I book, I will get that. Wow. Listen, he said, "Man, get whatever you want. I got you forty percent off everything." Man, I bought. Man, my boy, I, I came back with three Whoa. pairs of shoes, man. All Jordan, all new releases. Wow. Yup. I bull crap you not. So That's I build them relations. And, stuff right there. Yeah, I probably be going to him, man. See how it is. Uh, we'll see how it is, y'all. I got the, I got videos. I just didn't release them. I just didn't feel like editing. Them. I'm gonna have to hire my daughter or something. That's <laughs> what I probably do edit my daughter. Mm-hmm. Up there, mm-hmm. Keisha. Keisha sneaking another pair of sneakers, dude. Downstairs. <laughs> oh, is it Dale? He's sneaking another. <laughs> 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 Ah, uh, boy. <laughs> yeah, man. All right, y'all. I'm getting ready to take off. I love y'all. Y'all be safe out there. See you on the next one, guys. Peace. J Mac. We'll talk to y'all later. later. Y'all go. Hey, J Mac, you going? You're doing golf tomorrow? Yes, sir. What time? Uh, probably be one o'clock Eastern time. Uh oh, one o'clock. So, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. hey, the last person I saw Uno was like. Uh, plus 80. Dog. <laughs> I said, what the? F-? All, all I'm going to say is, it shouldn't take us three hours to play no golf. <laughs> hey, he was hitting, he was hitting people in the stands and all type of stuff with the ball. EMS came up on the crowns. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right, guys, we out this joint. We will talk to y'all later. Superdale signing out. Y'all be safe out there, guys. Peace. <laughs> Mm-mm-mm-mm.